hey you guys welcome back to the channel and thank you for clicking on today's video we have so much going on today and i'm just starting off with making my water bottle filling it up i try to drink at least two of these a day and then i want to start the video off with cleaning up my kitchen since we're here and I also picked up some spring clothes for Ava. We went shopping the other day looking for her Easter dress and then we saw there were some sales going on with the Cat and Jack brand. She wears uniforms at school, so I don't shop a lot for clothes throughout the year. So we are doing it like very far and few between and it was time to get her some new pieces because it is warming up. So in this video, I'm going to be sharing a Aldi's grocery haul with you guys. I'm also going to be adding a new tree decor in the house and I would love your guys' opinions on it because I'm kind of back and forth with it right now. And then we're going to be doing some organizing. I did pick up some new organizer, so I'm really excited to do that. I'm also going to go ahead and switch out my seasonings from their original packaging to glass jars and putting labels on them. So we have a ton to do in this video so I hope you guys enjoy it. One of the household cleaning tasks that were on my list today was to clean the microwave and I like to keep up with it before it gets too bad. Baby, can we kill this butterfly? Always takes too long, yeah too long, I ain't got all weekend. We had a good run, yeah a good run, but the clock is ticking. I gotta move on, yeah move on, I got things to do, all without you. Okay, so we are finally gonna go ahead and transfer all of my seasonings to these glass jars. I did get these from my sister-in-law. I also have these pre-made labels that I had picked up when I bought the hand soap and dish soap labels that I showed you guys in my previous video. So we are gonna go ahead and use those. And hope for better luck next time Cause I'm done with time consuming love, you see Baby, can we kill these butterflies? They live and then they die And that's the way I like it I just wanna move on with my life I've loved you for a while And that's the way I like it Like it, like it Oh, this butterfly's gotta go I just gotta be on my own I've been loving you for too long Oh, this butterfly's gotta go I just gotta be on my own I've been loving you for too long Too long Move on On my own I've been loving you for too long So today I wanted to share with you guys about a food delivery service called Factor. 
Factor provides balanced eating made simple. They provide a menu each week with dozens of delicious, nutritious meals based on your taste preference, dietary restrictions. Each meal is cooked from scratch by real chefs using the freshest ingredients and your orders delivered fresh to your door. So you can either cook them in the oven or microwave them. I have tried their meals before and enjoyed them and they just helped me reach some of my wellness goals and just get my eating and check. I do have some family members that actually use their subscription service on a regular basis to help them save time. And it's just nice because these are like chef made meals. They are so good. They also offer seafood, veggie, meat options, keto, calorie smart, carb conscious, and plant based. And then they also offer a complimentary nutrition coach with all of their subscriptions, which includes one 20 minute consult with a registered dietitian. That is really awesome. I'm going to go ahead and stick this meal in the microwave and we'll do a little taste test. Okay, you guys, I'm done cooking or microwaving my meal. It looks and smells delicious, so I'm gonna try it out. This is the blackened salmon with smoked Gouda cauliflower grits, quote unquote grits, and broccoli. But I'm really excited. Let's go ahead and just dive in and give it a try. So good. I always like to like mix my food. So I grab a bite of the grits and then a bite of the salmon. This is so good. Really, really good. Okay, I'm gonna try the broccoli because the broccoli, it has like some sauce in there. So it looks really good. I don't want, I don't like just like plain broccoli. I eat it because I need to eat broccoli, but I do try and like add stuff to it to make it taste better. That looks so good. It has like something, obviously. It almost has like a spicy, not super spicy, it just has like a kick, but it's almost like a chipotle, chipotle type uh, sauce almost. Make sure you guys go check them out. I'll have the link down below in the description box. Also use my discount code. I'm gonna finish this meal and then we'll get back into some more organizing. Okay, so next we're gonna go ahead and reorganize our activity cabinet. This is where we keep a lot of board games and Ava's art supplies. I have some organizers I picked up from Target, so we're gonna be using those today. So as you can see, it's super bad. Hopefully with these new organizers, it will give us a better system. We are gonna get this space organized so we don't have to ever see it look this bad again. I wanna be young. I wanna be alive. Everybody dance, don't stop. I just need a minute to find out what I'm feeling cause I'm about to go nuts And my team is trying to say he was up I'll be waiting for this my whole life Wanna do it again three, four times Cause it's better than a dream highway with young Lee I will never get in my head So hi, what a nice surprise You're all I ever had in mind I'm happy Okay, so now we have everything out of the cabinet. I just left those board games board games in there for now, but I think I'm gonna take them upstairs to Ava's room. She does have a lot of board games at the top of her closet in her room, so I just wanna put those together. Here is a lot of the stuff that I still have to go through. Uh, this is a trash bag that I already started with things that I knew were going in the trash, so I have a lot to organize through. So I wanted to show you guys the organizers that I picked up from Target. These are the Bright Room Stackable bins so there's this is the bin and then these are the trays and then right here we have the bright room four drawer organizer so first we're just going to go ahead and do a quick wipe down in here just because it hasn't been wiped down in a while i'll also go ahead and just do the inside of the cabinet doors i've recently done the outside when i decluttered through my kitchen um, cabinets i wiped those down deep cleaned those already and then what I also need to do is find a screw. Actually, I think this is, this might be the screw here that goes in here and I need to fix this because it's loose. I might be able to just do it right now. <laughs> there we go. 
So I need to screw that down to tighten it. So, so far I have her activity things down in that bigger organizer. I put her chalk, some science projects, little activity games that we have. I have a couple more I'm going to add there. I put her coloring books on the tray and then I'm going to use a couple more trays and add her notebooks and then also leave the top one for school stuff. So she has like a book report every quarter, a poem every quarter that she has to recite. So some of those things that I want to keep like in the kitchen and nearby, but she doesn't need to carry them in her backpack. That's where we'll put them. I don't know if you noticed, but I did go ahead and try to color coordinate like the home edit, if you know what that is. They're, they have all those organizers that I've used throughout my house and they also have a Netflix show. Well, they do this like rainbow color coordination. So I did it with the paints, but I'm also gonna do it with the colored pencils. I'm also going through the markers because there's a lot of markers that were dry. So I ended up tossing those. So we're all done with this space and let me tell you my daughter is so happy she is thriving she's like can you give me a tour so she's already been using it and going in and out of it so hopefully this system will keep everything organized i love how she's actually using it properly putting everything back in its place we do have room for extra organizers to add more in here as we go so i do like that idea as well so I did go ahead and order an olive tree from Target when they had their home decor sell. And so I'm finally opening the box and I'm gonna switch out the tree. So my goal was to put it in this corner, but when I put it there, I was not feeling it, you guys. I feel like it's more bare and I don't know what I'm gonna do. I still haven't decided. So you can let me know how it looks to you. I do love the tree, so I am gonna keep it, but should I put it in a different space where it doesn't look so bare in here? Or is it because I'm just used to this bigger tree filling up that corner so I still have to buy a pot for it so I'm not finished I'm just trying to figure out where I should put it Okay, so I wanted to show you guys what I picked up from Aldi. I did spend about $176, which is kind of comparable to what I spend at like a Fry's or Kroger store, except for this one, I got some different things that I don't typically get. I wanted to try out. Maybe some of them are a little bit more expensive on the expensive side and they're not like our staples. So I can't really compare the two. I also picked up a car phone holder. So that was about $22. So I probably did spend a little bit less. I went there because I see on videos that people actually get some of the food items a lot cheaper. So here are some of the items I picked up.
Okay, so now we're gonna go ahead and restock everything. I'm just doing a quick clean and just kind of wiping down things as I go. So this time I didn't wash my fruits and veggies before storing them. I just wanted to get them out of their packaging and into the containers and then we will wash them as we eat them. Better say something that will change my mind. Gotta give me something cause I'm not blind. All right, you guys, that is all I have for you today. I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to check out Factor. I will have their link and my discount code down below in the description box. If you enjoyed the video, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe if you are new, and I will see all of you guys in the next one. Bye, you guys.